confidence thing that you can't lack, you know, going in. You know, uh, Kyle definitely wants to get redemption, so we will see Kyle Doomsday in the blue. Mike with the red tape. Round one. Excited Three. finally to see some MMA action on the card. Oh, here. nice check hook there by Nothing Mike. wrong with the kickboxing more. And Mikey's going for a guillotine. He got the guillotine already. Oh. He does have a finish like this. Oh, and he slips out. Good job from Kyle, man. Slipping out immediately. Kyle's trying to hook the leg. But he can't. He, it's hard to get a sweep here when you hook the leg like that. So now he lets go. And now we have uh, Kyle in Mikey's guard. And Mikey's opening up with some body shots. Right Kyle's doing a good back. job of grabbing the wrist, but Mikey does successful when he gets up. And Mikey got the overhook here, pressing against the cage, using the right head, head pressure. pressure. Went for a knee, but he, uh, Kyle blocked it <laughs> with his knee. A beautiful knee there by Mikey. <laughs> yes. Oh, heavy knee to the body. Mikey looking to swarm. Now here, Mikey having Kyle in a dominant position up against the cage. Delivered some damage in that position. Exactly, too. to those ribs. And now more. Oh, those more knees. damage to the ribs. If the punches didn't do enough damage, these knees definitely will. And we need this is what we need to see more of. But good job from Kyle there. And now we have Kyle in side control. And Kyle's looking to take his back. And does. And he gets both hooks in. Looks like he's looking to sink in. He's looking for that rear naked. But he has to control, control the hips of Mikey there and make sure that those hooks are secure. And, you know, the, the, the cage is, pre is preventing Kyle from falling over if Mikey should tripod, right? Exactly, yeah. If he gets up on his toes right now and tries to shake him off, he's only going to shake into the cage. Mikey. Right now, Mikey's got a two-on-one. He's trying to, to rip that arm down and then turn into him. But Kyle still has those hooks, even from the back position here. Last 10 seconds. Looks like they're going to stay here. Kyle's starting working a couple hey, of yeah, punches Yeah, Kyle's there. landing some punches right here, and he's in a very good position. Wow. Exactly. That was a good first round. Yeah, here we right, go, round started. number two. Yep, round two. Kyle coming in with a nice high guard there as Mikey is just staying long, working the, the hands. Both fighters this second round here taking their time. Neither one of them is rushing in too much to – Engage for the grappling or just throwing bombs for the striking. Oh, There's as I say that, there you go, Mikey with the overhand and un <laughs> Looks like after that overhand, he's clinching. Mikey was looking to set up some of those. I want to see some more knees out of him to the ribs. The first round, he, when he had him up there for the first 30 seconds, he had him there, some punches to the ribs and knees to the ribs that'll definitely kick in there. If somebody's ribs are bruised and you know, beat up, then how are they able to breathe? How are they able to stand tall? There he goes, beating up the back of the thigh there. These knees are good money here for Mikey. What's the next move from here? You just try and keep him in this position and beat on him, or is, is he wanting to turn this into a takedown? Yeah, it looks it looks like Mikey is trying to take him down. Trying to knees. chop him down. Chop, yeah, chop those, chop that thigh. It looks like he's just getting right there in his glutes there with those with that power right knee. It oh. doesn't look like he's trying to take him down. If you know if it's working, now that last knee there caused Kyle Doomsday to fall to the ground, as Mikey is raining down those punches. Looks like he's transitioning to the back. Eventually looking for a rear naked choke, but right now he's just slamming down those punches. 
This is great control from Mikey Caicedo. Yeah, Kyle's trying to work his way back up. He needs to risk control and just get up on those toes and shake Mikey off. It doesn't do him any benefit here to just stay down on his knees and shell up. Because if Mikey rains down enough punches, the referee and yeah. the and if it's unanswered, fight. And if, if it's exactly. unanswered, Isaiah's gonna step in. Exactly. So he yep. has to reply. Yep, too many of those unanswered punches. And there it is. And there it is. All right, ladies and gentlemen, your referee calls a stop. In round number two, at two minutes and 19 seconds, your winner out of the red corner with a TKO stoppage, Michael Mikey Fit Casido. And congratulations to Mikey. Got, got the job done. He adjusted a lot, was able to get a better position in the second round, and got the second round TKO.